the last goodbye funeral home. Okay. Last goodbye. Oh, okay, cool. Jack's the in the prep room. In the prep room. Prep room. Oh, weird. I don't remember locking it. The key should be in the office. Why is it locked? Yo, there was a person out there. Here it is. So he died from a car accident. Is he bad or something? Huh. I don't know. Yeah, well, go in here now. I don't know how to shut any doors. Okay then. This is a creepy stairway. It is dark. I'm not sure if I'm ready for this. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm ready for it either. Marianne. Hey. Is this where Jack is? Hey, Jack. Don't do it. I got your special clip. No. Dude, he's gonna jump out at me. Don't do it. Snazzy. You wouldn't have it any other way. I didn't expect this to be easy. I guess I didn't know what to expect. When things get personal, it... It just burns you from the inside out. There. I guess you're ready. But Don't do it. Am I? Okay, he didn't jump out at me. I'm fine. <laughs> I was expecting a jump scare. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, can't you people read? The signs that's closed. <gasps> what is happening? It's dark. Yeah, 
that's just not the worst. I have to go check it out, huh? What the hell? Yo. Guess you felt it too, huh? And then it happened. As it did so many times before. Just when I thought my day couldn't get any worse. Oh, where is that star notebook? I'm gonna be late. Marianne? Oh, oh. Marianne, are, are you... are you crying, my child? Uh, uh. I... It, it's fine, Jack. Now, now, you didn't happen to see my notebook, did you, darling? Uh, oh, my memory's a bit fuzzy. So much for aging gracefully, eh? Listen, Jack. You should probably get some rest. Forget the notebook. Oh, no, no. no. I've got so much work, my dear. It's I, okay, I, Jack. No, I, I can't just... What? Let it go. Uh, it's not important. You, you would think I'm crazy. You are crying. What's wrong, dear? <gasps> oh, why is it so cold in here? <laughs> Is that damn so it's okay, Jack. It's okay. My sweet little Marianne. What would I ever do without you? Jack. Don't worry about it. It's time to get some rest. Oh, Marianne. Yeah? No. Oh, I, I, I'm worried about the surgery. When I'm at the hospital, are, are you sure you're going to be all right? Yes, Jack. It's going to be fine. Uh, oh, you, you know, I, I promised myself once I would never let anything happen to you. Not while I'm around. I'll be fine. I promise. Uh. <laughs> Risky stuff, then. Huh? All right? All right, Jack. Now, get some uh, rest. I, I need... Oh, yes, yes. Be, be good, Marianne. I love you, my child. I've loved you since the moment you walked into my life. Remember that. So whenever there's death, uh, I have to mess with the spirit, and that's right. Holy crap! I'm awake. That was kind of kind of scurry. Most people would give anything to have that opportunity to say all the things that were left unsaid, but it didn't make things any easier. I could help. A thousand souls cross over, but when it came to Jack, it still hurt like hell. I love you too, Daddy. Okay, that is her dad. I used to think everyone saw the world the way I did. Divided. Torn between two realities. No. I was the only one. Ugh. Or so I thought. We're closed. There's another funeral home across town. I can give you the number. I... Marianne. Who is this? You don't know me, Marianne. But I know you. Look. If this is a joke, uh... You need to listen to me, Marianne. Okay, I I'm hanging up. I know what you are. 
What? Who is this? My name is Thomas. I need your help. Uh, listen, if that's all you've got, I'm... No, uh. there's more. I can give you the answers you've been looking for your whole life. But I, I need you to trust me. Trust you? I don't even know you. It all starts with a dead girl. What did you say? The Neva Resort. Find me there. Please. The light, it's almost gone. It's not dark yet, but it's getting there. You're the only one who can stop it. You're my only chance. Hello? Hello? Shit. Okay. Amis, huh? I can tell that this game is gonna get creepy very fast. I feel like there's gonna be some jump scares in it. Cause those kinda scurry how there's the spirit like just chilling on top of the stairs. I don't know how about how I feel about that, but we'll be alright. in two different realities? Oh. And off I went. On nothing but a hunch. A call from a complete stranger. I'm a biker? I'd learned Let's to go. trust my instincts. And there was something about this guy, his voice. I felt like I should know him. Either way, he sure seemed to know me. So it's a random stranger who happens to know your name tells you to go to the woods where that girl died. Where you kept having nightmares. You just gonna go and listen? Dude, the, the, the guy that shot that girl, that was Thomas. I'm gonna die. Thomas is gonna kill me. The Neva Workers Resort. Right off the bat, I could feel there was something off about that place. I mean, look at it, it's boarded off. What am I supposed to do? Anyone home? I guess not. Look how old this place looks. Anyone home? Iwa says hello. By someone that's F with the name it starts with an F. Okay, so do I not need to be in here? The front gate was locked up tight. 
I needed to find another way uh, in. Did I just see something in here? It's a close hanger. What the? Hello? Thomas? That's a zombie. That's a zombie. I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh no. Oh man. You want to keep me out, nope, Neva? Nope. Even my bike. There's a zombie over here. <clears throat> I have no weapon. We're going to have to do better than that. So screwed. Not a whole lot of people knew about Neva. It used to be a government owned vacation resort. Until one day it just stopped. And this so is my running? An urban legend was born. The Neva Massacre. The details were always fuzzy. Crazed workers, ancient curses. You know, the usual. Oh god. This is Blair Witch. This is Blair Witch all over again. I don't know. Where's my dog? I don't trust it. Nah, a random ball just rolling in the <laughs> woods. A little kid laughing? No! Ball's gone. Huh. Hello. Footprints? Oh my god. That ends right here. Okay. Oh, okay, it keeps going. What's this? T plus K, 1968. Okay. Well, over 40 years ago. Uh, around 40 years ago. Get it. Hello. How are you? You wanted to play with your ball with me? Where'd you go? Huh. Looks like an old fort. Might be my way in. <laughs> are you serious? Do not trust this stupid. Oh my god, I've seen enough haunted tunnel videos to know where this is going. Warning, due to recently unearthed remains. Oh god. There's gonna be spirits in here. I'm so screwed. Something happened here. Yeah, and we're the smart white girl to go in here. This is how everyone dies in the horror movies. split would come and go. If a place had a story to tell, well, I guess I was there to listen. Oh my god. 
I'm so done. Dead. Like everything else in this place. Oh yeah, that's that's cool. I guess there's a little child drawing. Okay. Hello. What is that? The place felt old and soaked in misery. Figures, I guess. Thousand years of history doesn't just happen. It's paid what for. This? But even in the deepest darkness, light can linger. Lonely, fragile, waiting for someone to embrace it. As I absorbed the energy, I wondered who it was that left it behind. A dying soldier whispering the name of his beloved? Or maybe just glad to be done with this world. What's this? I, I don't understand what that does. Apparently I absorbed the energy. Now my arm's all glowy. Okay. Is that my defense mechanism? Like, is that how I fight spirits? I need to charge my arm up? I I don't like the camera. In any case, I figured I could use it. Energy's energy, right? Oh, so that worked. Good for you, Marianne. These powers of mine. As much of a pain in the ass as they were, they did come in handy sometimes. Oh, so I use it to help my real world, world self. Okay. Okay. following tracks awesome. so there I was oh, you're cold existing in two worlds but never really living in either makes sense 